Alrighty. So, I'm smoking dog bones. I've got a yard full of these things laying all over. I don't really worry about the heat. Dump some charcoal in there, throw some wood in there. Let it smoke like a bastard. But, uh, I'll show you what they look like when they're all done. Alrighty. That's about 30 minutes into it. Still getting good heat. I'm going to throw some ears of corn in here on the front of the grill. They'll take about 20 minutes. But I'll catch you up in a little bit. Alrighty. Oh yeah. They... The way I check them, oh, is when the bone marrow is soft like that on that knuckle. That really never gets soft, but that is, I like to cook them that way they're a little bit softer, so if they splinter, then they don't have as much chance of um, getting, oh, oh, look at that. If you decide to cook corn on the grill, you peel the husk back, butter and season it, and then put the husk back over the top. And if you've never tried that, it's awesome. But I got a big pan of lasagna, salad, French bread, garlic bread. So, anyhow, but the dogs will be out here chewing the hell out of them. What I do is I cut the knuckle off, and then those smaller bones, I let them chew on. I mean, I let them have the whole damn thing, but I cut this off. That way it's a little bit uh, easier to handle, and that knuckle doesn't seem to oh, break up as bad as the that sh uh, shank bone does. So anyway, I'm going to pull these, and that's the way I do dog bones. Later.